in the future to come, every one of us will receive enormous powers from heaven and will be so different than who we are today that it will be hard to recognize. The abilities of our mind, of our souls, are so high and so complex and so divine and so wide that a person today that lives under the rules of his nature is basically crippled, handicapped, he cannot move. He doesn't dream, he doesn't grow, he's stuck in his self-pity, in his pain, and in his fears, and he's terrified, frozen, cannot move, cannot move to take himself out of his own hidden place, from his own bubble, from his own cave. To go out to the world and to live. We're all so scared from what people will say and what people will think and how things can affect our lives that we're afraid to change our ways and to live our life based on our real inner faith. So even if we have an inner faith, even if we do believe in Hashem, we don't enjoy the prosperity of that faith. We don't enjoy the bounty of our inner connection to Hashem and we're just running and being observant based on fear, based on our assumptions that the world is a negative place, that bad things can happen to us. And we even don't recognize how good we are and how pure our intentions are from inside to set ourselves free from our mind prison. The prison that we are stuck in, in our own minds. Because you sit in your own mind and you don't let yourself prey on your dreams. It means that when we need a salvation, we'll do everything else except of praying to Hashem. But that's the only salvation. Because if you believe that there is Hashem, and that's the meaning of your faith, that there is a Creator to the creation. So now for you, at least in your mind, there is someone you can call. There is someone you can turn to. You can call him. The Gemara, the Talmud is saying that the difference between flesh and bones to the Creator is that flesh and bones, even to the most righteous ones of them, they still have a certain limit of abilities. How much they can take on themselves. Hashem is not like that. Hashem does not have that limit. Throw everything you desire on Hashem and Hashem will support you. Please subscribe and like this video and share it with your friends to help spread faith in the world. For more, please visit amuna.com.